What's up? It's Fred Hurt, and I'm uh, coming at you from Millersville, Georgia. Love to work at home.com. And uh, I don't know how my voice sounds to you right now. I'm a little under the weather. That's why I got the all this on right now. Um, hold, hold on, I'm getting a little orange juice. <clears throat> I don't even know if orange juice is a good thing when you're somewhat sick, but it just tastes good anyway. But let's get started. I'm here to start talking to you about home-based businesses versus corporate America. And the first uh, thing that I want to discuss is either you being your own boss or having a boss. Most people don't necessarily like the fact of having a boss. I know you've heard somebody, man, I can't stand my boss. I can do this job better than he can. Well, why sit up there and complain all the time about not liking what your boss does, uh, about you can do it better than your boss. He get on your nerves. He wait to the last minute to uh, have you do so much. He get to go on vacation and you don't. Why complain so much if you're not going to do anything about it? Because nine times out of ten, maybe ten out of ten, you probably are not going to get their job. I guess it depends on where you're at, but you're probably not going to get their job. So why not go and get your own? You know, in corporate America, that's what it is. The boss is here and you're here. They tell you what to do. Most of the time, they tell you what to do. Either they go and it feels like they just go and do nothing, which, you know, I can't really tell you because I'm not them. Or they leave and you're left to do the work. But in some cases, or a lot of them, that's their job. When you get in their position, you would probably do the same thing. But if you don't see yourself or if you're in a, like, Fortune 500 company and you know you're not going to ever get to that point or your goal is never to get there, but you just don't like having a boss telling you when you can and can't work, what you can and can't do, then your best option is to start your own business. And for most of you, home-based business is going to be the way you want to go because just average business, you know, startup costs are a killer. I mean, just a startup, it costs tons of money you know like for mcdonald's we're in the millions talking about startup mcdonald's and subway i mean i think at one point uh, a while back maybe subway might have been ten thousand i don't know where it is now it's in a thousand somewhere but you can start some home-based businesses for a low startup cost now i mean whether you, uh, whether you're willing to pay that is another story but when you want something else or you're tired of something that means you have to go out and do something different if you got to start your own business to get what you want, to be your own boss, stop worrying about the boss that you have now, then pay whatever it costs for whatever business that you're looking at. Because there are many successful home-based businesses that people have joined and actually left their jobs to be their own boss. Tired of having somebody else with their thumb on them telling them when they can do something, when they can't. They uh, sign up for a vacation. I, I heard uh, one internet marketer uh, with their own home based business say that they had took off for, I believe it was when they were younger. This was um, a, a college event. And they had took, take off, uh, uh, taken off for it. But because someone with more seniority came later, closer to the date, and wanted to take off, they got denied their uh, their leave. I mean, wh who does that? Well, your boss can do that if you're not your own boss. So that's something that I want to share with you about the difference between um, being your own boss or having a boss. It's all about you and what you want. If you're tired of someone telling you what to do, when to do it, then you need to get out there and get your own. Now, if you this has helped you to decide that, yeah, you want to look into a good home-based business, well, I'm going to let you start right here. Because I'm not sitting up here just telling you this because I'm not doing it. I have my own home-based business where I sell on eBay. You know, I use eBay and Amazon, two giants, to leverage me to be able to bring in extra money at home. So if you're interested in uh, using eBay and Amazon to bring in extra money for uh, you and your family, click the link below this video and, uh, you know, see what we do, what's in it for you, and, uh, you know, what, what uh, you can accomplish by being your own boss. Now, I'm not sitting here trying to make you quit your job right now, but this is a good start to, if that's something that you want to do, this is a great place to start. All you got to do right now is click this link, link below this video, put in your name and email address, 
and look at what is possible for you. So um, if you like this video, hit like, share it, uh, leave a comment, hey, subscribe to my channel, and I will see you on the other side. Be your own boss because you deserve everything that you want. Have a good one.